This is the captain. Captain, sorry to wake you. We just received an urgent message from Com Subland. You handle it, XO. I'll be right down. Aye, sir. Skipper's on his way. Morning, Captain. Morning. Eyes only. Could get exciting. Gentlemen, morning, sir. Mr. Wheeler just got this off the VLF wire. <coughs> Excuse me? Oh, sorry, sir. Orders, Captain? Give me five minutes, XO, and then join me in my cabin. Let me look this over. Then I need to see the two of you and Mr. Foster in the wardroom in five minutes. I'll need to see you in my cabin, XO. ASAP. Give me five minutes, XO, and then join me in my cabin. Aye, aye, Captain. Eyes only usually means the stuff starts heading to the fan. Eyes only. Compromised patrol area Yankee Victor, okay. 72 hours ago, Libyan Kilo submarine affected exit of Med gained open sea. Though tracked by U.S. forces, Kilo has broken contact. Subject sub is believed to be headed north at patrol area Yankee Victor. At present time, threat to your mission and platform is considered slight. You're advised of this developing situation, so you may take appropriate action. Disclosure of this message to your officers, men left to your discretion. Continuation of your deterrent patrol considered paramount, all other considerations secondary, subland sands, etc., etc. You wanted to see me, Skipper? Kilo class submarine is believed to have exited the Med. It may or may not be headed into our patrol area. I'm not at liberty to discuss the message, but it may be necessary to amend our patrol route. This is as serious as it gets, XO. Our patrol area may be compromised. Take a look at this. 
I worked at the Sosis listening post at Rota for two years. Submarines don't just sneak out of the med. Surfland is tasked with finding this kilo, and we're going to make sure they do. I want all officers not on watch to be in the wardroom in five minutes. How she got out is anybody's guess. I want a full tactical dump on Kilo-class subs, and let's brief Sonar right away. I'll tell Sonar we're on our way. Captain's in Sonar. Good morning, Captain. Morning, Mannion. Here's the new chart, sir. Well done, Mr. Foster. We're going to be doing a little hunting, Ensign. That means an increased watch profile. I want sonar on battle station's footing until further notice. I want you supervising sonar, Mr. Foster. Drag a cot in here if you have to. You were the sonar whiz in New London, is that right? Well, uh, yes, well, I suppose. Well, then you're the man, Mr. Foster. When can you have those watches online for us? Uh, I'll get them organized right away, sir. Uh, we're also going to need a full tactical dump, everything you've got on the Kilo-class submarine, including upgrades. Let's go forward. We were liaison authorized to talk to the carrier battle group. Let's get him on the horn. Very good, sir. Are we at war, sir? You'll be the second person to know, man, and I promise. Okay, guys, look sharp until I get this thing figured out. Subplant installed this just before we left Charleston. Have you seen one of these before, Master Chief? You ask a lot of questions, Lieutenant. Captain's on the bridge. Officer of the deck, come to periscope depth. Periscope depth, aye. Extend SATCOM mast. Extend SATCOM mast, aye. Very well. Who do you want to talk to, Skipper? Mr. Wheeler, get us Admiral Plaskett's battle group. Call sign Charlie One Tango. Sir, CEO, USS Ida. Three whiskey. This is Charlie One Tango. Actual. Send your traffic. Morning, Admiral. I received the message from Com Subplant, sir. Do you have additional information about the compromise in my patrol area? You know as much as I do, Captain. I can tell you this. That kilo didn't sneak out of the bed on my damn watch. As far as your patrol area being compromised, I wouldn't sweat it yet. I'll find this kilo. You just stay out of my way. If I were you, I'd watch my six. Plask it out. Here you go, Skipper. Captain Exo. Got the nav materials you asked for, Skip. This is the uh, passage chart, sir. This is patrol area Yankee Victor. Our current position via VLF nav fix is here, Waypoint Lisa. Our current heading is 045. Our speed is 5 knots. At best speed, what are the probable positions of a submarine that exited the Mediterranean 72 hours ago? What class submarine, Captain? Kilo class submarine, export type, possibly with a performance upgrade. Export. Kilo. 11 knots surfaced. 17 died. Performance upgrade, 19 or so. So, I'm a kilo boat and I managed to sneak out of the med. Naturally, I assume that every swing and dick in the U.S. Navy is trying to find me. So, I play hide and seek. My best speed isn't 19 knots, it's 10. And I sprint from layer to layer. And I'm getting real paranoid playing hide and seek. I'd say he makes 525 nautical miles. Very good, Chief. Well, gentlemen, that establishes an uncertainty zone of 300 nautical miles, 200 miles of which cuts into the southern edge of our patrol. I'm not comfortable with that. Bottom line, he could be here already. So what do you want to do, Captain? That diesel boat probably made 500 nautical miles. We get down there fast, we'll get there first. Standard speed will be sufficient, but let's go deep. See that the sonar watches are doubled as... 
Aye, sir. Have those courses in main control five minutes ago, gentlemen. Aye, sir. XO, let's go see Webs. Aye, sir. Who pulled his chain? I can't get it done that fast. Boss well, goal's starting to look pretty good, isn't it, Mr. Foster? Good morning, Captain. XO, what brings you to the Devil's Workshop? What are you doing here, Webs? Little PMS on the guidance systems. Strictly routine maintenance. How's your readiness posture, Webs? SOP, sir. War shot loaded in tube one, three fish in ready service. Load two tubes with war shot and keep your powder dry up here. I'd like to put us on an increased readiness footing. Double your watch section until further notice. Aye, aye sir. XO, hey, Mr. Foster. Um, I've got a problem I want to show you, sir. <clears throat> we just pulled the tow to Ray for scheduled maintenance. It's a routine thing, you know, a couple hours of downtime. Faster and funnier, Anson. Okay, okay. So, um, well, it's really weird. It's this sort of sound short. It's, it's an intermittent buzz at about five hertz. And the volume changes with our speed. When we go fast, it gets loud. When we go slow, it gets soft. Did you try isolating it with the other passive sets? Was it a malfunction in your gear? Well, I thought about that possibility too, sir, so I cross-checked using the other towed array, the TB23 and the WLR9. They both heard it too. You said the volume changed with speed. Is it some kind of hull effect? Maybe, but uh, we've been clean and quiet since we left Kings Bay. Uh, I don't know, maybe something broke up top. Maybe we fouled the prop. Do we have a problem, or are we worrying about nothing? No, sir. That signal is way under what anybody plays with. Sometimes you can't sweat the small stuff, sir. This isn't worth exposing the ship. How long would a hull search take? We'd have to bring the ship to 100 feet minimum. And we'd be hanging out in the surface layer, sir. That's not a real great place to hide. The hull search can wait until that kilo... I want to lock out a diver, XO. I want a thorough hull search. Are you sure, Skipper? Do I look like I'm sure? All right, I'll notify the con. We'll conduct a lockout immediately. Sir, please insert disc four to continue. Satellite communications. Satellite traffic for the Admiral. Admiral, Miss Matthews, CIA. Should I patch her into the bridge? Admiral. Pipe it into the flag bridge. Admiral Plaskett? Can you see me? Good. When are you going to let me tell these people what's really going on? Two hours, Admiral. Two hours? This thing could go nuclear. CIA, out. Flattery. Cold, dark, scary. Open your eyes next time. Let me see this. Very nice. Now somebody tell me what the hell it is. Doesn't look electronic. <sighs> Found it under the port sailplane, Captain, about nine feet. Let me see it. Maybe you better let the ordnance boys have a look at it, Captain. This thing might go bang. Good idea. Get it back to the Ching. And I want answers. Chief, get this thing back to the chain. Tell him I want a briefing in the ward room. Ten minutes. Aye, sir. Did you brief like the bird? Two hours ago. We got uh, dipping sonar, Mark 48 torpedo, sonar boy, oh, yeah. and 16 pack of those ding dongs you like. You're a beautiful man, Danny. Let's go hunt a little submarine.
15 guns were missing. Gentlemen. Okay, sir. This was attached to the cell six feet from the deck. This device was affixed to the ship by a lever action suction cup. All right, Chang, but what was making the noise? That was a tough one. No electronic parts, three moving parts. I had no idea until I found this. Looks like a reed of a clarinet, only it's made of titanium. This whole gizmo is an acoustic generator, an underwater whistle. We move, the water streams by the hull, and this little puppy sings. Okay, now we know what. Let's find out who and why. Anything but I'm willing to listen to a list of suspects. Who had the opportunity or motive to stick that thing on the hull? I say we start grilling the line handling party. Who was in it the day we sailed? Deck division. Holland, William, Schaefer, Benvenides, Browning. Who else was on deck? I was. I was the last officer topside captain. Who was the last man down the hatch, Wheeler? Petty Officer Holland. Well, I say we get his ass in here. I agree. Master Chief, get Holland in here. What about you, Wheeler? Did you pass by the... Anything strange happen in the line handling party, Mr. Wheeler? Anybody go forward? Anybody pass by the sail? Petty Officer Holland, sir. He showed up late. He almost missed the boat. I chewed him out. He almost missed movement, and you didn't put him on report? No, sir. He had gone to mast just two months before, and I didn't want to see him lose another stripe. Am I to read this, that I'm under suspicion here, sir? Everyone's a suspect, Mr. Wheeler, until I find out who put that whistle on the hull of my sub. And you saw nothing, Wheeler? Nothing at all? No, sir. Not a thing. Master Chief, get the line handling party in here now. Aye, sir. Everyone that was on the aft line, and the aft line only, one step forward. Get out of my sight. Forward line, same deal. Get lost. Starboard side. Out. What lines were you working, Brimley? Fore and aft, sir. I was the petty officer in charge. He was with me the whole time, XO. What about you, Holland? Aft line, sir. I was supposed to work, except I was late. What side of the sail did you pass as you went below? Port side, sir. I was the last person down. Ward room, Holland. Now. You're dismissed, Brimley. You as well, Will. Aye, sir. Thank you. You put that homing device in the hull, Holland. Why were you late? I met this woman. I overslept. I was kind of hungover. Your file's a joke, Holland. 24, page 13 entries. Two counts of disrespect. The last one was an accident, XO. That homer was found nine feet up the sail. Who helped you put it there? I didn't do anything, Captain. I never saw that thing my whole damn life. Master Chief, you gotta believe me. Well, I don't, Junior. I think you're a lying sack of grits. 
Do you know what the penalty is for sabotage? Huh? Under the Uniform Code of Military Justice, it's death, petty officer. By firing squad. Convince me, Holland. I really want... Who told you to put the homer on the... Who told you to put the homer on the sale, Holland? Who told you to do it? Nobody. I didn't put nothing on the sale. Why don't you believe me? You planted that homer. I was still drunk when I came aboard. You can ask Mr. Wheeler. Let's try it again, Holland, from the beginning. I told you, XO. I was late getting back to the pier. I heard that already. Why were you late, Holland? I closed down the bar at the Raven, sir. I met this woman at the Cape Henry Club. And before you knew it, I was late getting back to the base. Well, this is getting us nowhere, Skipper. What do you want to do? Captain, why don't you and the XO step out into the passageway for a little while? I'd like to talk to Holland alone. Okay, Master Chief. You've got five minutes to make him talk. Try not to break any furniture. I'm placing you under arrest, Petty Officer Holland. The charge is sabotage. Master Chief, confine him in the quiet spaces. Come on, Matahari. I don't know. Maybe he did it. Maybe he didn't. Unfortunately, he's our only suspect. Sorry, Skipper. To continue, you're going to have to insert disc 3 now. Main control sonar, hydrophone effects, transient torpedo doors opening, bearing 350. He's got a flood tubes in the choir. We've got about 20 seconds, sir. Get me a Sound the general alarm. Take evasive action. Sound the general alarm. Battle stations, torpedo. Battle stations, torpedo. Battle stations, torpedo. Con, sonar range to torpedo door event approximately 9,000 yards. That's going to be a long shot, even for the best kind of torpedo. If we evade, we ought to shake it. My intentions are to return fire and break off contact with a hostile submarine. Battle stations, torpedo. Snapshoot, two, one. Firing point procedure. Standing by, sir. Captain, I have firing solution. Do we fire? Continue to close with target vessel. Prepare to launch torpedoes. Con, hostile weapon contact now bears 325 range. Firing point procedure, Sierra. 8,700 yards. Four shot loaded, two one, sir. Speed, 65 knots. Orders, Captain. Stand by. Updating firing solution. This is getting to be a little more dramatic than it needs to be, sir. Torpedo continues to close. Range 1,000. Torpedo bearing opening. Range 1,150 yards. 1,200. Set 65 has changed course. New heading 240. Countermeasures have taken effect, sir. The torpedo is headed back at Sierra 25. His own fish is chasing him now. Set 65 is circling back, sir. Torpedo has resorted to active homing. Set 65 detonation, sir. Range 10,000 yards. Could he catch his own torpedo? The kilo is either history or he hit the auto-destruct on his own torpedo. Sonar, con, state your contacts. Nothing, sir. Sonar holds no contacts at this time. Breaking noises. Wreckage? Uh, no, sir. Nothing. Uh, Kilo-class submarine has broken contact. Hey, Captain, your presence is requested in sonar. Captain's in sonar. What do you got, Ensign? What do you make of that, sir? It is as far away. One convergence zone, two, yeah. Somebody want to start speaking English? Is it the Kilo? No, sir. 
the, the kilo is behind us. This one's north, way north, about 120 miles. Acoustic Library says it's a Russian Akula class sub. She's making about 34 knots at that speed. She's making more noise than your average train wreck. That's why we can hear her. Terrific. Looks like we got a new playmate. Can you give me a course and speed on this contact? Conversion zones are only about six miles wide, sir. Her speed is constant, about 34 knots. That would make her 110, 120 miles away. Now, I can't be exact in terms of bearing, but my best guess would be 180190. She's pointed right at us. Skipper, I can have a brain dump for you on both of those submarines shortly. Uh, I'll go get Master Chief. We got a lot of work to do. Thank you, Anson. I want to get a good look at the chart. Give me an update on our situation. I think I have a grasp of the tactical situation. Well, the Akula submarine, Captain, I don't know. She's not making any secret of her location. Now, why is that? Huh? I mean, why would you travel at all ahead flank unless you want the whole world to know where you are? Maybe that's what he's trying to do. Maybe the Akula isn't even a play. You mean the Akula's deliberately trying to give away her location? Maybe the Akula's trying to drive us south. Into Killer Kilo. Skipper, I just got an idea about flushing out that Kilo. It's weird, but it might work. You got about 20 seconds to get me interested, Master Chief. Start talking. Well, it's kind of illegal, sir. Maybe you ought to meet me in the car. Might as well see what he's up to. Hold the speed on. Capitan. Capitan. How's our high pressure friend doing? Akula's making 39. Moved into the surface layer, but he's still hauling ass. Why doesn't he care who hears him? They must have heard you talking, Skipper. Akula's slowing down. He's changing course. Coming up steady on 190. Target's gotten all stopped. Send his position to the battle group. Already bursted into him, sir. What's this guy up to? You know, back in the evil empire days, we used to torture Ivan in the Met. We'd broadcast sounds, car crashes, cows mooing over the hydrophones. You know, we'd give him some culture. This story have a point, Chief. Yes, it does. Because I think that Kilo is still out there. He's just so quiet that we can't pick him up. But I think I can get a rise out of him. Can I have that underwater phone, please? Sounds exactly like a Mark 48 torpedo. If he's out there, we'll know about it. Con, sonar, hydrophone effect, contact Sierra 25, evaluated to be Kilo class submarine, making 17 knots on one seven bladed propeller. Range 10,000 yards, bearing 160, running like a rabbit. Get me a firing solution. 
Firing point procedure, Sierra 25, 21, single fire at cap. Con, torpedo reports 21 ready, sir. Orders cap. Stand by. Break fire, 21. Weapons, con, tube one, single fire ad cap, stand by. Weapons standing by, sir. Shoot. Mark 48 ad cap torpedo course 045, run is enabled. 8,500 yards to target Sierra 25. Mark 48 running, sir. Sierra 25, course change. Now steady on course 130. Target speed 17 knots. Mark 48 continues to run. Course 045. 7,000 yards to impact. Like waiting for a Valentine, it's never going to come. Target Sierra 25, course change. Now opening. Target course. Zero nine zero. Mark forty eight continues to track. Get us closer. Break. Prepare to fire second torpedo. Firing point procedure Sierra two five tube two single fire at cap. Weapons all tubes ready, sir. Orders cabin. Stand by. Fire tube two. Shoot. Torpedo has gone active. 60 seconds to impact target Sierra 25. 55 seconds. 50 seconds. Con sonar target course change. Sierra 25 now steady on course 060. Speed unchanged. Sierra 25 has altered acoustic signature. Con sonar Sierra 25. <laughs> Contact is now classified as an Ohio class SSBN. Torpedo safety recognition is activated. He's pretending to be. We don't have an option, General. Place Mark 48 in command mode. Order the torpedo to kill Sierra 25. Captain, that torpedo disengaged because it thought that kilo was us. As far as that torpedo knows, there are two USS Idaho's out there. We order that ad cap to acquire and kill. We got a 50 50 chance of catching our own fish. I gave you an, thank you. I gave you an order, XO. Put the Mark 48 into command mode. Order it to kill Sierra 25. Weapons officer, place Mark 48 into command mode. Mark 48 running, sir. Order the torpedo to acquire and kill contact Sierra 25. Mark 48 has acquired. Con sonar, Mark 48 has gone active. Con sonar hydrophone effect. Mark 48 ad cap detonation. Range 2000 bearing 045. Did we get him? Hydrophone effects! Kilo's breaking up, sir! We nailed her! Oh, yeah. 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 Quiet! Yeah. Quiet in the con, right now! At ease, gentlemen. Torpedo has gone to active homing. Hostile weapon continues to close. Torpedo continues to close. Range 1,000. Torpedo bearing opening. Range 1,150 yards. 1,200. Set 65 falling astern, sir. Screws are slowing. Engine stop now. She's out of gas. We've outrun it. Sonar, con, state your contact. Torpedo is no longer a factor, sir. Sonar holds no contacts at this time. Sir, please insert disc four to continue. On watch. I just got off, Master Chief. Get back on. I just came from the cook. Can you talk to him? About what, Axel? About the trash disposal unit. Captain asked about it yesterday, and I told him you'd take care of it. Well, you lied. Now, you want to tell that to the old man, or would you like me to? Just leave it as it is. That's right. It's been making the same noise since we left King's Bay. It's trying to chew something up. Something like this? It looks like one of Wheeler's sensitive little tea bags. I'm telling you, this thing fits somewhere. Little help here, Chief, huh? You're the engineering genius, sir. Son of a... It is Wheeler. It's 
Let's get the captain. Captain, I think we know who put the Homer on the sail. Wheeler, one of his tea bags was stuck to this. I'm going to my cabin for my sidearm. Place him under arrest, XO. I'll save you the trouble, Skipper. You stay back! I want everybody back! Captain, I want everybody back! Now! Stand off, gentlemen. Come on. Stand back! Don't do this, Mr. Wheeler. Stand back! What do you think's inside of here, guys? About four or five hundred pounds of C4, that's what. And about 50 gallons of torpedo fuel. That'd make a pretty noise, wouldn't it? Put the gun down, Wheeler. You don't really want to hurt anyone. Uh, especially the folks back home, huh? Another espionage scandal. Now that hurts people. That shakes their faith in the American way, huh? Why, Wheeler? Why'd you do the it? The money. Back in the 80s, the Russians used to pay real well. But that sort of dried up. I really thought I was done. I thought I was out of it. But they came back to me right before we left Kings Bay. And they told me that they wanted me to attach that gizmo to the sail there, or else they'd go public with our little past performances together. And that would have been embarrassing. Now you're going to kill 155 men. Exactly. Well, goodbye, gentlemen. Oh! wanted to cold cock an officer. I thought I had you handcuffed to your rack. He did, Master Chief, but I had a Swiss Army knife in my pocket. I had to use the head, so I fought my way out. Put yourself in for Sailor of the Month, Holland. Cuff Wheeler better than you did Holland, Master Chief. Can someone take this from me? They really make me nervous. Give me the stick, Brucey. We've got negative kill numbers. We've got to get back to the boat or we're going to swim. With the sonar. Active? I want to drop a Mark 48 on their back deck. He's setting up a torpedo shot. Con sonar hydrophone effect contact Sierra 27. Evaluated to be a Kula class submarine making 15 knots on 1 7 bladed propeller. Captain, Akula has gone active with her sonar. She is setting up a firing solution. Guess who she's aiming at? Take us deep, XO. Put some distance. Get Break contact. Get us out of here. Helmsman, make turns for 35 knots. Oh shit, he just fired. We're right over the bastard. Tell them we can take him out right now. Negative. Charlie 1 is not clear as hot. We were ordered to hold fire. We gotta do something, sir. We got an idea. Look, Commander, we've got negative fuel numbers. Let's plan some music. Incoming torpedo has acquired. Torpedo is active. Torpedo continuing to close. 200. Sound collision alarm. All hands, collision alarm. Con sonar. Something's going on. What is it, sonar? I don't know. Somebody's jamming the set 65 sonar. Put it on the 1MC. Is deflected course, sir. Uh, new heading 180. Pull up the hydrophone. Ensign's right. Give us a course back to the boat, Danny. You phoned us. Relax, Brucey. We're gonna make it back to the boat. Look, Commander, I can do the math. We're gonna splash. Why don't you go back and give Danny a hand, Bruce? Help him kick out the Mark 48s and disarm them. 
that you're gonna ditch two live torpedoes? Mr. Neff's right, Skipper. They weigh 2,300 pounds apiece. Pull the fuses, disarm them, kick the sonar panel out if you have to. Need to lighten this bird up. Relax, man, we're gonna make it. Man, we're not gonna make it. Stand by. XO, VHF radio traffic. It's a friendly SH-3. He's declaring a fuel emergency. I got my hands full right now. It's Ice Cream 27, sir. He's not going to make it back to the carrier without a nav fix. Those are the guys that jammed the Akula, Captain. I think we owe him. Do I have to remind you we're in a torpedo battle here, sir? We'll give him a fix as soon as we deal with our... Come to Periscope Depth. Give him a nav fix. Very good, sir. Officer of the deck, come to Periscope Depth. Deploy VHF mast. Aye, aye, sir. Sparks, stand by to transmit range and bearing to the battle group. Aye. VHF traffic from USS Idaho. They just person us a range and bearing to the battle group. Bearing 178, range 60 miles. We're going to cut it close. Five knots of headwind and we're going to be in the soup. <laughs> Do the math, Bruce. We're going to make it. Con sonar hydrophone effect, Kula class submarine making 15 knots on 1 7 bladed propeller. Firing point procedure Sierra 27 2 1, single fire ad cap. Con, torpedo reports 2 1 ready, sir. Captain? Weapons, Con, 2 1, single fire ad cap, stand by. Weapons standing by, sir. Shoot. Mark 48 ADCAP torpedo course is 045. Run is enabled. 8,500 yards to target Sierra 27. Mark 48 running, sir. It's Sierra 27 course change now bearing opening target course 090. Mark 48 continues to track. Ready, tube 2. Firing point procedure Sierra 27, tube 2, single fire ADCAP. Weapons, all tubes ready, sir. Target Sierra 27 course change now bearing opening target course 090. Mark 48 continues to track. Microphone effects. Akula breaking up, sir. She's going to the bottom. Quiet on the con. Quiet on the con. I want absolute silence Incoming right torpedo now. has acquired. Torpedo is active. Torpedo continuing to close. Torpedo has gone to active homing. Hostile weapon continues to close. Torpedo continues to close. Range 300. Sound collision alarm. All hands, collision alarm. Torpedo continues to close. 200. Torpedo bearing opening. Range 150 yards. 200 yards. Oh, baby. It's a clean miss. 500 yards. Torpedo continues to pass astern. 800 yards and still opening. Torpedo self-destruct, sir. 900 yards. Sonar, start. state your contacts. Okay, Torpedo is no longer a factor, sir. Sonar holds no. Say again, no contacts at this time.
Yeah. Green's right or right? Of course, Green's real fine. Wild Bill, sir, he wants to talk to you. You call the Admiral Wild Bill. Uncle Bill and I go way back. Bravo Zulu, Idaho, well done. You can be proud of yourselves. You've brought the world back from nuclear annihilation, defeated the forces of evil, and generally kicked butt. I'm going to put you boys in for some basket leave at the end of the month. Thank you for letting us be of service, Admiral. For those who stand guard, freedom has a sweetness the protected will never know. You done good, Idaho. Godspeed. Plas get out. Nice job, Skipper. Waiting on new orders, sir. Surface the ship, XO. I think I'd like to get a little air. Very good, sir. Officer of the deck, take us up. Surface the ship by.
That was it, Sergio. I'm a massive stud, man. Check. Slater's his name. <laughs> Y'all ready? Okay. Here we go. Cut. <laughs> That's the confidence builder right there, Tony. Thanks. <laughs> Action! You go, hey! You know, like oh, hey! Yeah. Oh, hey, guys! Yeah, exactly. Oh, okay. Yeah, Roll like, hey. camera. Rolling. Hey! hey. hey. Yeah. That's a beautiful thing. Thank you. It's a big boat that went by. A big boat? <laughs> Specifically. Is that a naval term? <laughs> All right, get back to your watch station. Watch that. Aye, aye, sir. Aye, aye, sir. And here we go. Looking at the camera and. Going up. Give me speed. Action. Let me get the. Here we go. Very good, sir. Great. Give us a kiss, Skipper. Helm's dog. All ahead, flank. Wait for doggy paddle. Helm's dog, repeat order. Okay. It's an underwater whistle. And it sings like a little bird. Oh, man. Pup. Damn! Okay. <laughs> I, I'm, st I'm, yeah, I'm just getting a little... Con I'm just the finger signal. You that's what I am. No, no, yeah, that's you're fine. Just the finger signal. Okay, I, I keep... Gotcha. Sorry about that. Zoom finger signal. It's not the skipper's job to switch. Okay, gotcha. That's acting, though, bud. Whoa. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I didn't say Simon Says. <laughs> what do you make of that, sir? Well, a little training bra, <laughs> kind of a swing. <laughs> No, I didn't know if that was the line. <laughs> mm, lunch. Did I screw that up at the end? Did I? No. Okay. No, not at all. Alright, the $64,000 question is, who clipped it to the <laughs> <laughs> okay. Back to work again. Here we go. What's this next line? This next one's why, Wheeler, why'd you do it? Okay. That hurts people. Shakes our faith in the American way. <laughs> God, stay with me, John. Okay, here we go. And was that like totally? Ridiculous? <laughs> Don't worry about it, Joy. Yeah, Sorry, I. These lines are in there. <laughs> Gertrude activated. USS Submarine. <laughs> Captain, if you do me a favor and uh, insert disc three. <laughs> when you give me that freedom, it's when I really shine. No, Oy vey. I like that. That's what I like. Why do I wink at him? <laughs> it was a lovely to see you, Captain. You boned us, Captain. <laughs> Why I'm smiling. All right, all right, never mind, sir. I'd like to thank everybody for all the hard work. Thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we got it. <laughs>